meet an entire family of ball tenders. Grandma Dottie Matten, Dad Chris Ball, and stepson Riley Durkin. Three generations, all ball tending this week at the Sony Ericsson Open. Well, it's taken a while to make it happen, but it did. Uh, my first year was 2000, and I just wanted to get as close to the players as I could get. I love the game. We're a tennis family. Um, and it took a while for my son to be able to adjust his work schedule and for my grandson to get old enough, but this was our year. Dottie has been a ball girl for the last nine years and is one of 400 ball tenders at this year's event, more than at any other tournament. Oh, it's good. We do a lot of things together. We're a pretty close family and so whether we're uh, out there on the tennis courts at our home hitting the ball around or we're out here um, helping out the, the tour, we're, we're out there working together and it's been a lot of fun. The ball tenders in Miami undergo five days of training and screening which begins in October. In order to give as many people as possible an opportunity to taste at first hand one of the best tennis tournaments in the world, the majority of the ball tenders are rookies, while the average age is just 14. That statistic could go down though if Dottie Matten gets her way, although Riley is likely to be back for more. It's fun. Uh... It's a great experience being a ball kid, and it's great just to have my family here with me. It's awesome. I hope so. I might, uh, I'm a USTA official, um, so I might switch to the official end of it. Um, I am 64, so <laughs> the body is taking its toll.